Video 2 of 6. Use Wordalyzer to create word clouds in InDesign. Installing Wordalyzer. So the first thing we need to do is install the Wordalyzer script. And there's two versions of Wordalyzer. There is the free version, uh, which allows you to try the application out, or try the script out. And there's also the paid for version. So I've already downloaded the paid for version of Wordalyzer. So what I'll do now is I'll show you how we install this into InDesign. So I've placed this on my desktop, but normally it will be downloaded to your downloads folder. And it comes as a zip file. So if I double click on the zip file, it opens up as a folder. And if I double click on that folder, uh, we can see here there is a file called Wordalyzer Pro JSX. So what I need to do now is go into InDesign. So to install the script in InDesign, the first thing I want to do is click on the window button and then come down to Utilities and click on Scripts. And then I want to click on the Scripts tab so I'll see two folders, Application and User. And the one I want is user. So now I right click on here and click on reveal in Finder. So now I've got on screen both my Wordalyzer Pro, the contents of the Wordalyzer Pro folder and the Smips folder in InDesign. So in the Wordalyzer Pro folder, we can see here we've got a file called wordalyzerpro.jsx. If you've downloaded the trial version, it'll say wordalyzertry.jsx. So what we want to do is we want to copy that into the scripts panel. So now when I come back into InDesign, we can see wordalyzerpro.jsx. And to run that, all I have to do is double click on it. And you can see now that we're now running Wordalyzer.